Hello again, it's still Thursday, July 25th, and my car drives perfectly straight, like an arrow, and uh, I'm on my way home up the 400, and one of the things that's been driving me nuts for a little while is, I love this hat, but it uh, has that bacon kind of strip here, where it gets all, because you're sweating into it, it makes it all wavy. And then when you take it off, you got these dents in your forehead. When I first bought this hat, it was just like, oh, it was such a perfect fit. And it was all smooth and nice on my forehead. And over time, as you sweat into it, it uh, does that wavy thing. If any of you guys have any ideas on how to unwave it, that would be great. I've heard about people putting their hats in the dishwasher. I've heard about soaking it in a little bit of detergent and then using a toothbrush and, and that helps get the salt stains and stuff out of it and helps clean it if it's really dirty. But, and I think Lids has a, I don't know, a little device that you can put your hat in, but I think that would stretch it over time. And then, then I, I like the Flex Fits hat. So it's basically like a little bit of a snug, elastic but not too snug i need like extra large on mine so that it doesn't give me a headache i'm not sure how many of you guys love flex hits i hate snapbacks i love flex fits like that just so there's no snapback and then i don't get a sunburn in the shape of a crescent moon on the back of my bald head so uh, i like the flex fits hats they're my favorite anyway i thought we'd stop in at the mall and we'll go to, to two of my favorite hat locations. One is Lids, and the other store is like a sports store where I buy most of my jerseys, and I bought this hat because Lids didn't have flex fits, uh, this style of hat. One of my favorite hats was the one that Ben bought. It's a flex fit. The whole thing was gray. Even the logo was a very low profile, not flashy hat, and I really enjoyed that. I enjoyed the look of the hat on Ben and I really wanted to buy one too. But I don't want to buy the exact same hat as Ben. But uh, I'm not sure if he wears it anymore. I think he might still have it. I'm not sure if it's dead in the water. But I think if we park, doesn't matter where we park, the two stores are kind of far apart. So we'll try and park closest to Lids. I kind of know where that is off the top of my head. But I haven't taken you guys shopping to this mall in a while. Chances are, last time I was here is to buy a jersey or a hat. I can't remember. Too many videos. All right, let's go in there, see uh, if we can get a new hat, see if they can give us any information on how to fix this hat. But I look forward to your information on how to fix this hat. So comment away, I'll read all your comments. Just trying to find a regular parking spot. Uh, I think this is the best door to go into. So let's park in this little spot, a couple little trees here can't wait till they're bigger so they give you even more shade let's go shopping that's where ben used to work oh lids is closed hmm guess we'll come back I can smell the food court from here. It smells like subs. Sometimes I think it's up here on the right, but I think it's down here and then turn left and then it's on the right. I love gaming stores. Got some cool stuff. Oh yeah, all-star sports. They got good stuff. Good stuff. Oh, that table is hilarious. Look at that table. Big Blue Jays chain. Argos. Got to get to an Argo game this year. I'll take a look. Sure. Oh, that looks good. Like a little flex fit. It's my favorite. And my head is extra large, so this is medium. Oh, that's not bad, actually. That's funny, because... Yeah this, yeah, this one's large, extra large, but this is 
I've accidentally bought medium before and it like gives me a headache. Yeah. That's pretty good. It's a nice fit actually. It's pretty subtle. My son has a had a gray one, like it's kind of like the green one, but it was the whole yeah. thing was gray. Well, it's like this. Yeah. It was all gray. Are you looking for a curved or are you looking for straight? Curve. Okay. So we've got this one here. We've got the new J one. Pretty sweet looking. Yeah, that's very cool. Oh yeah. Mirrors right at the very front there. Sure, thanks. There you go. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Have a good one. Thank you. I like it. Like that one? Sold. Okay. I'm returning this one. Just kidding. <laughs> Fifty-one ninety-seven. I like to pay. These are. Uh, these keep getting more and more expensive. Eh? Yeah. Be 12 bucks. <laughs> Fantastic. There you go, sir. Thank you. Well, that's cool. If you love your football, then you can get that bracket to hold your television. That's great. What do you guys think? Looks good. It says Toronto on the back. Hope you like it. So it's $45.99 plus our Ontario taxes came to like basically $52 for a hat. Wow. I'm planning on going to a Blue Jays game soon and uh, I'll be interested to see how much they charge down there. Ooh, Imperial meats. Look at all this yummy food. Now I'm hungry. Well, happy I got a new hat. I'm gonna take these stickers off. I know some of you people out there love your stickers. Let me know if you love your stickers on your hat. I don't. I just like wearing hats. Keeps my bald head. See, $45.99. $45.99. Jeez. Keeps my bald head from getting burnt. That's what it does. Sometimes keeps you a little bit warm. I like it. What I liked about this one, this one has like almost like a foam. So it actually is like padding. So like this one is a little bit thinner. Definitely thinner. You can almost see through it. Although well, you can see through this one too. Oh, that's funny. You can see through this one more. This one, again, is stretched a little bit for sure. It was kind of like doing this wavy thing at the back too. I guess because I hang it up. I usually hang it up on a hook here, but it curled it. So it would be nice if that stayed straight. But again, it has like a, like almost a foam to it. So when you like put your hat on, you put your hat, it just feels like it's got all nice and super soft and foamy but I like the new hat let me know what you think in the comments below I appreciate that I'm gonna open my window a bit let's go full sunroof I bought it use it or lose it use it or lose it nice so you can also leave a comment in the comment section below as to what your favorite team is and do you wear their apparel and do you also go to the games? So let us know and we'll get some discussions going. Don't bash each other. But don't bash each other's teams just because you don't like them. Just be nice. Be nice to each other. Whoa. Got to leave the... For whatever reason, the Volkswagen Atlas, and I think I think it was the Atlas and not the Tiguan, maybe both cars, I can't remember, it's been a while. But if you drive with one window open, two windows open, it doesn't matter, you get that whoa, 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 thudding sound in your ear canal. And so you have to open up a third window or the sunroof to stop 
the shape of the car from making the wind vibrate in your eardrums. So right now I've got that one cracked, this one cracked, that fully open. And now let's let all the heat out and it won't suck my eardrums out of the sockets. If there are eardrums and sockets. Let's go home, show my hat off to the cats, see if they like it.